Hello, I'm Casual K for Beat Stop Power. Today I'm going to show you an easy way to add some movement to your beat. A lot of times you can have a nice beat, but it can get stale if it's if it doesn't have any movement to it. So what I'm going to do in this video, I'm going to actually link the detune parameter right here in this vaporizer to synth to your controller on my MIDI um to a knob on my MIDI controller. So what I need to do is move this around a little bit, right click on this multi-link to controller. Click link to controller, move the knob on my MIDI controller, and now I have full control over this. So when I go to record, and I'm going to record notes and automation, and you can hear how I can add some movement to this. Hear that little wave? So by just re um, recording the automation or the, I guess you call it automation into your beat, it's a lot easier, it's quicker than going in with the automation clip and try to draw points. So that's one way of, one way to add some movement to your beat. I'm Casual K, y'all have a nice day.